Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing okay and that you've had the most amazing week. So tonight, Callum and I are going to Shanique's birthday party, which she's got a theme for. The theme is Met Gala. So we've got to go all dressed up, all glam, like the works, everything which I'm actually really excited for because I've never, apart from prom <laughs> and maybe my mum's wedding, I've never been like this dressed up before. So yeah, I'm quite excited for it. So I have ordered this dress, which I'm going to be wearing tonight. It is a strapless black dress, like, a ball gown type thing and it's got a slit in it so i'm quite excited to wear it and to go with this dress i have been gifted some jewelry which i'm very very excited about now you guys know me and you know i only ever really wear silver jewelry but recently i have been starting to try to wear gold jewellery if it will go with an outfit so I wear I wear silver jewellery on a daily but if the outfit needs gold jewellery then I will wear gold jewellery so I've been sent three bits which I looked at on the website and I, I basically chose three items that I liked and they sent them to me so I've got a necklace, some earrings, and this cute little bangle to wear. So this is the necklace that I got. Just a cute little bow and the earrings. This is just one. The earrings match. The earrings match as well, which I thought was really, really cute. And then there's this bangle, this gold bangle, which looks like it's got like leaves going all across it. It is honestly so cute. I actually love it. So yeah, I'm really, really excited to wear these with my outfit tonight. So I got gifted these by a company called Saga Jewels you will find them on instagram and if you go through their website and you see any jewelry that you like if you use the code amy15 you will get 15 percent off so yeah i will show you what the jewelry looks like when i'm fully changed at the end but if you go on their website and use the code amy15 you'll get 15 percent off of your order so yeah, go and check those out. Anyway, let's get into the get ready with me because I need to get my hair and my makeup done by the time that my mum comes round in possibly 40-ish minutes because she is going to help me get into this dress because the back of the dress is a lace-up corset kind of thing and Callum doesn't finish work until quarter past seven so he's literally got to run through the door get changed and we need to leave so I need to be fully dressed and ready by the time that he gets home so that we could just run out the door when he's changed so I've asked my mum to come around and help me get into the dress so yeah this is gonna be a fun night so let's get started. Like I said, obviously it's like a full glam thing. So for the first time in like four or five months, I am contouring, I am eyeshadowing. We are everything tonight. So yeah, I haven't put contour on in so long. So let's get into the video. Let me grab my mirror. Okay, so we're starting out with the contour, but obviously I'm just gonna use my solar powder bronzer from soap and glory yes for anyone who has watched my videos for the past couple of years 
I have used this every single time. I know I need to get a new one, but I don't use it enough to be able to fathom getting a new one. So we're just going to deal with this one for now. But yeah, let's bronze me up. Mate, I've got hairs everywhere. My hair is just falling out of my head and it is doing my absolute nothing. Right, that'll do. Not too much because I don't want it to be too prominent, but it's done enough to make it look like my head is, my face is, is sculpted a little bit, you know. Right, eyeshadow. Now, I'm wearing gold jewellery. So let's do a brownie goldy eyeshadow look which my sister will probably watch this video and go, ugh, why are you doing that? But it's what I know, so leave me alone. Right, so I'm going to go in with my Kick Into Neutral palette from Soap and & Glory and I'm going to use the shade Cuddly Bear for the base. That was my eyeball. Right, that's the base done. Next, I'm going to go in with my Gold Rush palette, which is from Primark. And I'm going to go in with the gold shade. And see how this looks. I don't know whether to do this one or whether to do the more darker one but we'll see how this one looks first if not I can always go over go on top with the dark one because you know experimentation That'll do for that. I don't know whether to do some like brown eyeliner. Do I have this like goldy brown eyeliner from MAC? It's called Power Surge. I don't know if I should try doing that. It needs a bit of a sharp. I might have to go off camera for this one because I need to get close to the mirror so I'll be back in a sec. Right, eyeliner is done. Now on for mascara. So let's curl my lashes.
mascara going in with my triple x extreme volume mascara from revolution oh, my eyes watering just from doing it curling my eyelashes what the hell Mascara on. And for blusher, I'm going in with my one from MAC in the shade Ambering Rose, just because it's a darker shade than my other one, which I definitely think is necessary for tonight because we are going big and bold, and I'm even wearing a red lip because I had an idea of doing red lipstick and then wearing my red heels with the dress so we're doing gold red and black tonight and I've gone a little bit more out on the blusher than I usually would just because I want it to stand out a little bit more and then for highlighter, I'm going in with my Hit Highlighter Palette. And I'm going to do the more bronzy, goldy shade for this so that it's not directly matching the colour of my eyeshadow. Damn, I'll tell you what I've forgotten to do. I'll tell you what I'm about to do. I've forgotten to do my eyebrows. So going in with my clear eyebrow gel from Revolution, just to make it so that they don't look so ragged. I can see all the tiny hairs underneath starting to grow back. Okay, and that is my makeup, apart from my lipstick, which I will put on after I'm pretty much ready. But I'm going to show you what lipstick I'm going to wear, which is my one from Sheen in the shade Prophecy, which is like this bright red and it's a little bit sparkly as well. So I'm really excited to put that on. So yeah, that's the lipstick I'm wearing. For hair, I'm going to just straighten the ends. I'm gonna do like a slicked back ponytail, but I'm gonna do it as like a lower kind of ponytail. So it's like down that hanging there and then straighten all the ends. So I'm gonna put a bit of gel and hairspray in the front and then straighten the ends. So let me do that and I will come back to you when my mum is here helping me get my dress on. So see you in a sec. <laughs> I don't know how tight you want this back there. No, I'm struggling to breathe a little bit. Oh, here. are you? Well, you could have said. Better? Yeah. Yeah? There? Yeah. <laughs> you leaving this out or are you tucking the bow in that in? Tuck it in, I don't want it on. Are you in? Yes, I'm in. Good, right, tuck that in. Right, so my mum's helping me into my dress. 
she's also done my hair because <laughs> I was halfway through it and she went that don't look right so she did it herself Put my brand new gold jewellery on and put some red lippy on and my shoes and we're good to go. Okay, that's it. I am ready to go to Shanique's birthday. I've got my dress on and some signature red heels, which we love, but they are definitely not going to be shown because this dress is so long. I am just so short, but it's really cute and I honestly, I love it. I've never worn anything like this before so i'm actually really excited but yeah so the dress the heels cute i put on my red lipstick and then i've got on my gold jewelry from saga jewels honestly i actually love it i just think it's so cute the earrings and the necklace match so well and even though the bracelet isn't meant to match with the necklace and the earrings because it's a different name basically all of their jewelry on the website have names of what they're called so the bows of the earrings and the necklace have the same name they match and the bracelet has a different name it is actually funnily enough called draco which is obviously a character from harry potter which i absolutely love the harry potter franchise <laughs> poor poor professor mcgonagall she died it's so sad but anyway yeah so i'm honestly in love with this jewelry so if you like it Go check out their website i will definitely be tagging them in the description below and don't forget to use the discount code amy15 to get 15 percent discount off of your order but yeah so that is the end of this get ready with me i'm literally just waiting for callum to get home now so that he can quickly get changed and we can run out the door and then we are ready to go so yeah i hope you all enjoyed this video Please like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.